what's probably going to be a very funny vlog for you guys. Kind of an embarrassing one for us. Today is pyjama day in support of Julia's House, which is an amazing children's hospital who rely on charity donations to give children who desperately deserve to make happy memories with their families. And we are supporting them and raising funds by wearing our pyjamas all day today and we have a, do a just giving page so if you guys can donate we understand some of you can't but i'm just saying if you can there's a link down below go and show your support and i hope you guys enjoy this vlog this is how chris took the girls to school pretty funny looks on the school run this morning let's just say that i kind of thought i'd got away with it because i don't have to do the school run on the morning i'm very lucky i've got a great husband and i don't need to do the school run however I have just remembered that Isla has a dance performance at school this afternoon, which I have to go to. And not only do I have to go, but I have to sit in, in a crowd of parents in my pyjamas. I probably will be so mortified that her mum and dad sat in the audience in a pyjamas, especially Chris's, that she probably won't be able to even concentrate. Prinny is not in her pyjamas this morning. We should have thought about getting you some, shouldn't we? Yes, mummy, you should. Do you want to go in the garden? Yeah, full. <laughs> okay guys, we're going to start this day by heading out. We're actually going to go to our P.O. box because we've not been there in a while, have we? We've been kind of busy and we've not managed to get there. It's right over the other side of Leeds. But we're going to start today off by heading over there and collecting some of your letters that me and the girls will read through tonight whilst Chris is in Leeds. <laughs> Skating in his PJs. <laughs> So we just set off, we've had builders in the street laughing at us and looking at us like we are literally going crazy or something. Looking at us as though we've just forgotten to get dressed this morning. <laughs> but guys, I just did a Twitter post saying if you guys make a small donation or whatever donation you can make, screenshot it, tweet us it and you can give us a dare. So we're just, I've just this second tweeted it. So we're going to wait and see if we get any dares coming. They have to be within reason. If it's a dare that says something like, go swimming in your pajamas in Ilkley River, that's not gonna happen guys. <laughs> but if it's like a dare within reason, like a fun one that we can do, we're gonna do it. Are you excited for this? No, I hope the dares right, come right. all for you and not me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only joking. I do really want to take part. How funny would it have been if this was tomorrow and I had a driving lesson? I had to do my driving lesson in my pyjamas. Oh my gosh, that could give someone an idea for a dare, so I'm going to be quiet right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, I just went on Twitter to see if anybody had taken us up on our dare offer. Amy Palmer, you absolute little savage. <laughs> she has just dared us, guys to go and have lunch in a pub and we can't cheat by going to Greg's. In fact, it says no cheating, Chris, by going to Greg's. So this is obviously just one for you. No, I'll fall. I'll do you can do it, you can do it. So we've got to go for, for lunch to a pub and when we're paying, this is the worst part, like this is so bad. When we're paying, we have to say, don't you know who we are? Can't we get a discount? <laughs> oh my gosh. Guys, I'm not joking. I can do that. Look. Look, are you gonna do that? That's so embarrassing. We're stood there in our pajamas. You gotta bust it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'll do it. Amy. I'll do it. I can't even deal with myself in the camera today. Good morning guys, how's it going? We just arrived at our PO box. We're just about to load up the back of the car with as much stuff as we can take home. <laughs> this is so funny. Okay, so over Twitter, Instagram and Facebook last night, I asked all of you guys to vote for which pyjamas that I should wear out of three sets. The majority of votes were for number one, which is this one, and for number two, which is this one. So it's very, very split. So I just decided to wear both today. So I'm rocking both Jurassic Park <laughs> and traditional pajamas kind of you know what I mean basically I got a lot of funny looks on the school run this morning it was very very funny I'm actually regretting wearing <laughs> um, shorts because it's been so hot and sunny all week and it's been beautiful weather so I thought I won't bother getting long pajamas because it's nice and hot and I don't want to be too hot because I don't tend to have any long pajamas I don't wear them but it's freezing. <laughs> it's not warm today at all. And I've got on all. these little, uh, tiny shorts. <laughs> we're going to get a lot of looks at school this afternoon oh. when we go to see Isla do her dance performance, basically, is what we're saying. It's going to be it's going to be funny, guys. It's going to be very funny indeed. See you in a minute, guys. <laughs> I don't dig it out. There's so many people around. <laughs> Everyone's looking at you. We've got to go shopping, look. Come on. looking at you. We've got to go to get our got your shopping. bum bag on. <laughs> 
Oh my god. I've got no pocket, so I have to wrap my bum bag today as well. Oh my gosh. We love the bum bag. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys. I don't look like I've got pajamas on. Yeah, I do. Oh my gosh, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I'm keeping the camera out so that people actually realise we're doing something. I'm keeping the camera out. I do need a trolley. No. Yeah, oh my gosh, yeah, we do. And I don't leave me sitting on my own. I'm going to stand in the corner, guys, where no one can see me. <laughs> I absolutely love that Chris gives no cares in the world. And he's literally outside right now, just like, okay, I'm good. Oh gosh, security's coming over to me. Oh gosh. <laughs> to do this that wasn't quite too bad so to get over doing something like this that's really good cause for charity and you really want to do put your head down and don't stand tall like a pineapple put your head down <laughs> put your head down grab your food and run babe you need to go grab your food guys and run and it's honestly not too bad <laughs> no I'm just joking we're almost done we're almost Done. Oh my goodness, some people can be so judgmental, it's not even funny, literally. The amount of people that have tutted at us. You guys! <laughs> anyway, we're back to the car, Chris is just taking the trolley back. And then we're going to drop off our shopping, we've got some things that need to go in the fridge, and some fresh bits that need to go in the fridge. And then, after we've done that, we are going to make good on our dare that Amy gave us. And she made a really good donate. She actually donated twice. So we can't not do this dare. So we're going to go and drop the shopping off. And then we're going to go and find a, like a pub or a pub lunch. And then we're going to, oh my gosh, I'm not saying it. I could never say to someone, do you not know who I am? Like, that's going to be so embarrassing. Guys, there's so many people sat outside eating the lunch. <laughs> it's going to be so bad. There's so many people here outside. Literally, it's going to be bad. There's so many people sat outside and you're just... I wouldn't feel so bad if I weren't with you. <laughs> My pyjamas are not even that bad. <laughs> Yours are bad, boy. Oh, Look God. at people's face. <laughs> <laughs> that guy, like one of those guys has just said to his friend, oh my gosh, look at that guy. <coughs> Choosing his mains. Delicious, I'll delicious. Like this is where we're going to do that dare, right here in this pub. You've got to do the dare. Yeah, this is going to be very impressive. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys, this looks utterly divine. And yes, I did already take a big juicy bite out of my wrap already. Looks so good. This is Chris's. Oh. It looks so delicious. Yeah, they do look delicious. So we just finished up eating our dinner. What is wrong with this camera? It's really low down, pointing downwards. Yeah, we just finished up eating dinner. We have three people come over to us asking why on earth we're sat in pajamas. So we told them, spreading awareness. But now, my husband. Guess what it's time for? You need to go pay the bill. Alright guys, I'm literally about to take on Amy Palmer's challenge from Twitter. Amy, if I get thrown out of this restaurant and barred, I'll be coming for you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, can I pay the bill from that table there, please? Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I'm gonna laugh and give this away. Oh, thank you, that's not right. Thank you. Wow, 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 that's a bit high. You able to put some discount on that? Don't you know who I am? No. I don't expect to pay bills like that high. That's really high. That's two wraps. <laughs> I gave it away, guys. Alright, so today I'm basically I'm being sponsored by all of our fans basically to go and do challenges that they set us through Twitter or Instagram. And I'll just set a challenge to come and say basically like, yo, don't you know who I am? I'm not paying that bill. So that's why I did that. Because they don't think I'm so weirdo. That was a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be, guys. That poor woman looked at me like as if I was literally crazy. That 
went not as well as I expected it to. Literally, I couldn't carry on with the poor bar lady who was looking at me like I was an alien. I, to be fair, bless that bar lady. She said that it's such a good cause, you guys. Let me go speak to my manager and see if you can have the meal for free for what you're doing. And then obviously we would have donated the meal price to the charity. But yeah. the manager said no. <laughs> She's like, no. Okay. <laughs> Awkward. So moving on, we've just had another two dares on Twitter. So from I Heart Brittany, she's dared Sarah to start singing the Frozen song to the next random person that she sees. I will actually do that, but I can't do that to the next person I see because the next people I see are these two people here. And they're having quite serious meetings, work meetings. So I will do that to a random person, but just not the next one I see. And then um, and then she's also dared me to skip down the street with my hair in pigtails, which my hair's not long enough to put in pigtails, so that's probably not going to happen. But Laura Rostron has asked if I will skate by some people tonight in my pyjamas singing the Juicy Pineapple song, so I will definitely, yes. definitely do that for sure. Okay, guys, spotted my victim. I'm going to go and sing to her. He literally looked at me and walked off as fast as he could, as though I've like stood here with the lurgy. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to go find someone else. I love the little old man in a car that's just driving off. He just uh, smiled at me, so I'm walking up to the car now. I'm gonna do it to him. Ready for this, guys? You look like you're in a good mood today, sir. Yeah. Do you like the song Frozen? Do you like the song Frozen? I've never heard of it. Do you want to hear it? Let it go, let it go. Can't hold it back. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! That's so funny! <laughs> Everyone in this girl box is looking at me right now! Everyone is looking at me right now! Oh my god! Nobody else give me any more dares! Hi guys! So I've just come home from school. Got changed into my PJs, which are really nice. Mum bought me these uh, yesterday. And I'm actually on the, my way to Lisa's house because on a Wednesday, the girls have dance. And Daniel, will be going out skating. Oh, oh thank nice you. Oh, guys, this is my new case. Okay, wait a second. This is my new case. So nice. Thank you. It's really nice. I love it. So yeah, as I was saying, I'm going to, on a Wednesday night, Mum goes to dance with her granny and the girls. And I normally just sat there doing nothing, so um, I normally go to Lisa's house on a Wednesday, which is really nice. So I get to spend a few hours with her. And that is it for now, guys. Okay, guys, so I've just arrived at Lucy's house. Lucy just got dressed and are about to head off to the park. We're about to have a grass fight, don't start. <laughs> We're about to have a grass fight. Lucy, no! <laughs> Oh, so we just got home after a very eventful, in fact no, it was uneventful, time at dance. Very, very well done to these two Yay. big girls who danced. In fact, I don't think that the iPhone have not seen your pajamas. Sat there freezing in these because they're not the warmest of pajamas. But here's how I've made in all of her classes today. Embarrassing. <laughs> they don't even look that much like pajamas, yours. Yeah, that's why I asked. That's why I asked. Make a good guess. Shorts and t-shirt one. Shorts and t-shirt one. This is mine. She definitely looks like when she's got pajamas on. <laughs> you do. They are very, very cute. I and like then obviously, mine. I'm so comfortable in them. I literally would go out this in any day. I don't think yours look very much like pajamas either. So, can you two go and change? Yeah. Oh no, you don't need to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe just brush your teeth. Come on then. Come on then. Go. Good job there's no water in there, isn't it? So I am just sat with Esme and Isla chilling. Hello. Chilling, yes, sweetheart. I would like to do one day. What would you I like, would like to, to do? Have the camera for a full day. Just you? And just like, yeah, just me. But you can come out with me. Oh well, yeah. And um, <laughs> and I want to film like just um, everything we do. Like an Isla cam, but for a full day. Yeah, an Isla cam for a full day. Oh. And like um um and like do a mon 
a morning routine and a night routine on the same day. Oh, so it's like a full day of Isla. Isla cam, but all day. Yeah, I'm just... On iPhone extras? Yeah. Oh, that's what Isla wants to do, guys. She wants an Isla cam, but for a whole vlog. But, but um, only me in the channel. But she's very adamant that there's only allowed to be her in the vlog. <laughs> just an Isla cam. Maybe the iPhone would like that, Isla. Your perspective of the day. She's already setting a date, guys, so whether you want it or not, it might be coming up. Friday? Friday? Friday's well, week. Well, next week is half term, so maybe you could do that one day of a half term. Yeah, but this, this Friday we're waking up. You are, but you are at school all day Friday. What? You didn't tell me that. What? <laughs> of course you're at school all day Friday. I said we're not. Yeah, and I said we're breaking up on Friday. You break up on Friday, but you still go to school for the day on Friday, don't you? <laughs> you can watch TV for 20 minutes before sleepy, okay? You got 20 minutes, say goodnight to the iPhone. I'm sure they don't want to see your little cheesy toes. <laughs> <laughs> Esme Alexa, <laughs> same for you, Missy, okay? 20 minutes on oh, Musical.ly, okay. I guess. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's you crazy girl. Say goodnight to the iPhone. Good night, iPhone. Good night. <laughs> um, can I give a kiss goodnight? Go on then, you give the kiss, boo. And uh, no one else is allowed to vlog after me. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to have to be very quiet now because Anna just told me I can't film after she's done the kiss. So, I kind of didn't want to end today's vlog like that. As I wanted to speak to you guys a little bit about today. I'm going to go into Isabel's bedroom right now and say goodnight to her before we end the vlog. Hello, you two. Hi. <laughs> Prinny's in such a giddy mood. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, Pushy? I did, didn't I? Did you see me? Did I look like an Olympic runner, is he? Did I look so cool? We are so impressed. <laughs> You had a good day today, babe? Yeah, I have actually. I've had a good day. Only a couple of days left and then it's half term. Yeah. You excited? Oh, yeah, I'm so excited. Nice, so some nice tired. sleep sins. Because oh, I've got such long days, I'm so tired. Yeah, Isabel goes to school at eight and she finishes at four, so that is like eight hours. A day. A day. And even when she comes home, she's got dance or homework, dance usually. or homework. Like, yeah. Guys. But anyway, two days left. Okay, so you're going to the air fam. Good night, guys. So after a very long and very, very productive session in Bradford just now, we've just jetted all the way over to Leeds to meet up with Mark and Rich. We're going to spend the last bit of sunlight that we've got just getting a few more clips over here. It's been so much fun and <laughs> it's definitely been an experience skating in my pyjamas. But hopefully I'm going to be able to make good on that dare that you guys set me earlier today, that Laura Rostron set me earlier today to sing Juicy Pineapple in front of some people. So I'm going to do that very, very soon, hopefully. But I am really happy. I got some really, really good clips for my video. So hopefully I'll be able to show you guys it very, very soon. I'm really, really, really happy. My brother was a legend and he came out tonight and he filmed like a trooper all night for us. And yeah, it was so, so good. Ba, ba, ba. All right, Laura Rostron. See all these people chilling in this bar? <laughs> a juicy pineapple, a juicy pineapple, a juicy pineapple, a juicy pineapple. Was that good enough? Please tell me that was good enough. Did I earn the money? <sighs> I have to skate back past them now. Yeah. Cheers guys. <laughs> so I'm going to end today's vlog here guys. I'm going to get myself a cup of tea as usual because I'm obviously such a rock and roll mum. Not. Get myself a cup of tea and uh, probably reply to some of your comments on the vlog. Actually, just before I do, I'm going to do a question of the day which goes to today. Samantha Jewel asked, when do the girls break up for half term and do you have, have anything special planned well as you probably just heard upstairs with isla yes they break up for half term on friday so friday is the last day i know some people around the country have two weeks off my girls only have one week off this half term because they had two weeks in april so i have one week off and we do have something very exciting planned we actually are going somewhere on 
Friday for the long bank holiday weekend. It's somewhere that we've never been before. It is in the UK, but it looks amazing and we are so excited. And then we have a few jobs to do for a day or so. And then we've just heard something today that might mean we're going somewhere else during half term. And I'm not sure if that's going to come off yet. Hopefully it will though, but it's definitely going to be a very exciting half term for sure. I just want to say what a great day today has turned out to be. I want to thank all of you guys for donating to our GoFundMe page. At the moment, we're a quarter of our way there to our goal. And I just can't thank you guys enough for showing the amount of love and support and encouragement that you have done to us all today. It's been, I actually thought going to the girls' school would be the worst part, but actually I think Morrison's was. It was just so busy and I just felt ridiculous. But I would do it all again tomorrow in a heartbeat for such a good cause. So instead of giving this video a thumbs up, if you liked this video, if you feel like you can donate, if you can, then instead of clicking the thumbs up, click the link down below and donate to something that's incredible and so well deserved. Show your support to us and to Julia's house. We are going to leave our donation page open for the next, I think, two weeks to hopefully reach our goal. Hopefully you guys will help us to get there. Thank you all for following us on Twitter and our Instagram. I know most of you have been laughing your heads off at our stories on Instagram today. It's been so much fun. And thank you all so much for watching this video. We'll see you all again tomorrow at 5 p.m. Good night, guys. Hey, iFam. Thank you so much for watching today's Ingham family vlog. I hope that you enjoyed it. I definitely did. If you did, then make sure that you give it a big thumbs up to show your support to the Ingham family. As well as that, you can leave a comment down below and make sure that you come back tomorrow at 5pm for a brand new vlog. Thank you so much for watching.